Have you seen an eclipse? Remember, you should not see an eclipse with your naked eyes. There are special sunglasses for viewing them. But do you know exactly what happens in an eclipse? An eclipse is the overshadowing of a bright object. When the moon comes in the way of the sun, we on earth are not able to see the full disk of the sun. It is called a solar eclipse. Today, what we are trying to do is to simulate the solar eclipse. Imagine yourself to be on earth and looking up towards the sun and imagine this torch to be the sun. It looks small, but imagine this is the sun and between you on earth and the sun, there comes the moon. And as it comes and when it actually tries to cover a bit of the sun, that's when the eclipse begins. There the eclipse begins and if it completely covers it, it becomes like an annular eclipse and then it moves away to the other side and goes out. So basically what happens in a solar eclipse is rather simple. Between the sun and the earth, the moon comes covering the sun's rays from coming down to earth. The eclipse may be total or partial. While viewing the sun from the Umbra region, no part of the sun is visible and so it is a total solar eclipse. For people in the penumbra region of the shadow on the earth, it is a partial eclipse. Solar eclipses occur only on a new moon day. Similarly, a lunar eclipse occurs on a full moon night. In a lunar eclipse, the position of the earth is between the sun and the moon. The moon comes under the shadow of the earth. Based on the movements of the earth, the eclipses can be calculated.